Hey everyone, my name is Chang, and today we'll be learning about notes and repeats. So first of all, let's go to the music or the sound section of Scratch. We'll first of all create a new project in Scratch. And let's go to, let's see, oh there it is, play note. 60 for 0 0.5 beats. So the note feature of Scratch has two components that you can change. The note, so which note that like the thing would play, the program would play. So it has everything from low C to high C. These are notes on a piano. So middle C would be the very middle C of a piano. Let's hear how that sounds. Oh, we have to first go to event and one click, then it'll play. Okay. And then the other component that you can change is the beats. So this is the duration of the note in beats. Let's change it to one beat. See how it plays for a little bit longer? Let's change it to four beats. Okay. So those are the beats. You can make a song made up of multiple, let's see, duplicate, I'm going to try to make a song. Alright, so I've created a little tune of the piano notes, all playing at 0.5 beats, so you can see what Scratch can do with music. This is for Elise. So now it's your turn to make your own tune. Try that. The other component or the other feature of um, sound in Scratch that we can learn today is the rest block. Let me find where it is. Hmm. Oh, it's right here. Okay. So let's rest. If you know music, then you know that rest is just a pause in the sheet music and it just tells the musician not to play for a set amount of time and that time is determined by the beats so the musician won't play for that amount of beats let's make this rest for four beats so like four counts and then we can duplicate this and play it after that rest Did you notice the pause between the two, um, I guess, chorus parts? Well, there you go. That's the rest. And I would incorporate the, let's see, there's the repeat block that we can use. But none of my notes really repeat. But you can use this to, say, make a note, let's say, mm, let's make note 60 play for 0.5 beats 10 times. And let me just get rid of the song so that we don't have to listen to it all over again. And here we go. 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. So that's how you would use the repeat block to save yourself this long code or long list of blocks. Alright, have fun! Make your own song.